Beautiful day to go bike riding. I'm out of here at Integris Hospital, Edmond, Oklahoma. Gonna ride some park trails. Park trails, are, park trails are over in there. Takes you all the way around the part of the lake, gonna see part of the lake and see some nice uh Be safe in the midst of pedestrian traffic, free from all distractions, and strength to complete this ride. All right, in your name, Jesus, we pray. Amen. Okay, let's get loaded up. My bike's not even ready yet. On the rack. Some roadside art along the way. One that's actually art worth the rest is just the beautiful scenery we're talking about. Yeah. many hills on this one. If they are, they're not very challenging, but they do. You can't feel them on your legs, just say it that way. Okay, here's our first roadside art. Alright, what do you think of this? Is it movable? Oh yeah, they move. Well, just a bunch of bicycles all glued together. Some chains, springs, some brakes. Whoa! I don't see a name tag anywhere around here. If you know who made this artwork, please let me know in the comment section. The main path goes this way. There's another entrance to this uh, bicycle pedestrian park through to here. We'll go down there on the end of the ride. It's really fun when it rains, the water sweeps over the, the roadway down there. If it reaches a certain level, it has to go over a, a drainage ditch first. A gr drainage grit grade, we will say it. Hey. Alright, let's, let's go ride around a little bit, take in the scenery and the beautiful sounds of Arcadia Lake. That's looking east. This is looking south. That's looking west. Beautiful birds. All right. They provide little benches to sit on on this road for pedestrians and people who bike and they just need a rest or just want to take in a pretty view. It's 
so area they're fixing for sewage and another type of drainage. Beautiful area. This is where you actually get to see part of the lake as you're out riding the bicycle or jogging. Let's do it over here. Looks like kind of a swamp, <laughs> creek overflow area. place to swim but probably a good place to fish though. I don't know how you just do that in here. Here's a little bit closer view. Goes all the way over here. That's nice dry land and water. I have bicycle shoes and I'm not gonna chance walking out in there so I get get you all a closer view but this is pretty good. Think you like it? Let me know in the comment section. Alright, let's start seeing what the rest of the park looks like. Here is something very helpful on the trail. Place to put your bike and tools to work on. Put your bike up. And you load it on the, this fork here. There you go. And you got a little work area. It's donated by. I hope you can read that. It's Alice Bicycles here in Edmond. And Shamont Insurance Agency, Beverly's. And Dennis Shamani. Excuse me, I said that wrong, I'm sorry. Beverly and Dennis Shamont. What else does it have? An air pump, air jet, and pump up your tires. And all the necessary tools, even Allen wrenches. Hey, this is awesome. Thank you, Al. How's bicycle, Henry? <laughs> and Simone Insurance Agency, Beverly and Dennis. We thank you very much for this. land next to Arcadia Lake. We have the cows out running around. And it looks like they have an entrance, private en private entrance down there. It's not too bad. And the lake is just right over here. Oh, they were quiet. One time that deal of traffic and people is during park time hours. Some handsome cows, aren't they? Give those cows a thumbs up. Got a little baby calf there too. Closer view of the baby cow. A whole bunch of them I think over here. Calves. From church service. <laughs> Alright, let's head on. Without me telling you, can you make what this thing is? This is part of the drainage system. This must be one of their main outlets of water. It runs off the roadway, other high parts of the land, comes down through here. 
It's off the road, off that high part of land. Fills up and then drains through here, right to the lake. Actually goes on to the other side of the road. It travels down a little creek. That's pretty good engineering though. Another view from the drainage area from the top of the road. I'm riding that way, that way's east. She just drains right out the other side. By this, I'm always reminded of what direction to travel. trails they also offer this off-road trail for mountain bikes I don't know if all my mountain bikers coming down here or not I don't think so there's a leaf yeah, let's see the rest of the park be nice to ride that and see what the trails look like Wow, Woods. this is a pretty area all the rocks the drainage Got a lot of rocks over here. This must be another area that fills with a lot of water. From all the high parts of the land around the lake. And yeah, just one single drain here. Goes across the road. Now this drain down the creek and into the lake. Very beautiful. The trees. Well, let's continue on up that way. Open this trail before it was finished. Whew, I catch my breath. This was the entrance. You had to pay money to get into the park, and then you could ride the <laughs> ride the trail down to a bridge where there's a dead end. And you turn around and ride back to here. And there was only like ten car spots to park, ten parking spots available, and. This section was not open yet. This is just a dead end. But now they've opened this up all the way to the very front of the, I think it's Spring Creek entrance. And there's parking up there as well for maybe 20, 30 cars, maybe a little less. And it's free. Just if you get to the lake, you have to this pay. is the lake road. You bring your boats, your camping equipment. And this, you pay money, there's a paid side. You ride down this road to, a, I think, there's maybe a dock or something, some fishing and some camping, uh, picnic areas. And there's the where you pay to get in. We'll go and take a look at that here in just a second. Here comes the car. There's 
the end of the trail. We go down there, make a U-turn and come back. Here's the lake entrance. If you want to go into the lake, view the water and everything, and use these other paved roads, it's going to cost you some money to get inside the lake. Last time I was here was six bucks. It probably is probably different now. All right, so we'll be able to see the lake if we go on the other side. And let's go we'll take a look. Now, do if you recognize it in the video, let me know in the comment section. Here's the beginning of the back trail. Looking for my bike, you can see the lake right out there. And you can also hear the boats. Let's see if I can put this more of a narrow shot so you can see. Let me see a little bit of the water. Here's the sky, and then the lake is here. We see a little boat floating around out there. Okay, fresh battery in, leaving the lakeside parking lot. And what's another on this side? Leaving the lakeside parking lot, going past the pay booth, and ride back towards my car. And we'll, we'll ride past where we first came in and go towards the bridge where there's an optional parking that's on their Fox Lake uh, neighborhood. And they put a little parking lot in over there next to the interstate I-35. So let's uh, head that way. I was out here last week and brought my GoPro, but I did put a, a chip in it. We call this a Sims card. Frustrating. On the way back, I see a pretty good view of the uh, lake. Some more bicycle trails for mountain bikes. It's a pretty good view to the naked eye. On the camera, probably doesn't, it looks kind of small. I'll try to zoom in the best I can. As I'm riding back from the car to the car. Yeah, lake entrance. This is uh, Spring Creek Lake. That's I-35, north, south. And this is a water overflow area. Water comes in here, hits the grate, and goes under the street somewhat in the creek. And of course, there's so much water will flow over the street here, so you've got to be careful when you come out and ride after the rain. I don't know much sim. I don't have much Sims card left. That's the dead end down there. You make U-turn to come back this way, or you make a sharp left, you go up your parking spot. We're going to turn around, however, and go back to the Integris. All right, wasn't that fun to see all the, the trail up in the Lake Arcadia? The SIM card's pretty low, so let's say she'll probably get uh, saddled up to go home. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for keeping me safe in the midst of pedestrian traffic. Give me strength to ride on the park trails and return home safely. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. All right. If you guys like the view from the camera today, if you did, let me know in the comment section. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. By subscribing, keep you up to date and loop all my video uploads. And please turn on your bell. The bell is a post notification icon. It alerts you when I post a new video. Oh, please hit the like button on the video. That way YouTube will acknowledge that you're interacting with this video in some manner and your library of liked videos will grow too. It's a win-win. All right, see you guys next time. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.